Good morning, happy Monday. I hope you guys are doing well and had a great weekend. Today I grabbed the book Lion's Lullaby from the center last week, our favorite. So let's get started. At the end of the day and the start of the night, when the earth is half dark and the sky is half light, who put the animals to bed? What is that? It's a kitty's tail. Who helps the cat down from the shed? Uh-oh, he's stuck. Who finds the bear that went astray and quiets the dog that wants to play? Shh, dog. It's night-night time. <clears throat> Who picks the downy duckling up and soothes the yawning sea lion pup? Oh, look at him yawning. Look at the crocodile and his slippers. Who blows a crocodile kiss and asks the snake please not to hiss. Shh, snake. Who tells the elephant to close his eyes. It's time for that elephant. And sings the lion a lullaby. Oh, he's so sleepy. And who and when Tawny Owl goes, hoo 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 hoo, who whispers, hush, hush. Oh, tell me who strokes the tired old tiger's head, who puts the animals to bed. Is it you? Is it you? Well, snuggle down too with your lion and your kangaroo and your bear or your kangaroo. With rabbit and monkey, penguin and dog, gorilla and turtle, or maybe a frog. Look at the frog. And the rabbit. And the penguin. Give them all a big hug. And turn down the light. And with the whole wide, wild world, sleep in peace for the night. Night-night, animals. Night-night. <laughs>